Okay guys, so today we're going to go through uh, the code blocks and the Arduino IDE itself. Firstly, you're going to need to go to the Arduino website and install the Arduino IDE. And then also you'll need to go to the training that we offer online for the link to the code blocks. So firstly, open up the Arduino IDE itself. Okay, uh, well once you're inside the IDE, you need to go to tools. When you go to tools, you'll see block at Arduino. That is basically the code blocks. Click on it. It will take you to the code blocks environment where you can drag and drop your code. For the purpose of this video, we're just going to use the examples tab. Uh, so that will be up at projects. Go down to examples, open example. This will bring up a list of examples of, of code. So this will be example code just to quickly show you how the code works. So we're going to use the blink LED. So this will show you exactly how it will look when you drag and drop all the correct blocks. So what this will do is it will switch on one LED for one second, switch it off, wait one second, then switch back on again. So you might, you might ask, how do you upload the code to your Arduino? It's fairly simple. You'll see at the top right corner of the code blocks, you'll see a little arrow. If you click on that arrow, it will take you through to the Arduino IDE. The IDE will prompt you to save the sketch. It's a very, very good idea to save the sketch for in case you need the same code for future reference. Then you don't don't have to type it all type it all over again. You can just open up the sketch and copy and paste it, which will save you a lot of time. I'm not going to save the sketch, however. I'm just going to show you how the code looks. So this is basically how the code will look if you wrote it yourself. For those who are more advanced, this is exactly how the code will look. So the code blocks program that we use for the drag and drop is perfect for kids and beginners. It will learn you how to code and see in a very fast and fun manner. And you can also do it, your, uh, do it at your own time. You can also have a look before you upload the code. You can have a look at how the code looks. So this will basically teach you how to do programming in the Arduino. Thank you very much.